Hello everyone, I'm Simone Stanley here at On The Radar Hoops Sweet 16 at Lake Point Sports. Today I'm joined by Brian Edwards Jr., a class of 2022 point guard playing with B Mays Elite this weekend. Brian, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for having me. So Brian, I have to start off by asking you, you have a lot of SEC schools in your top six. What is it about SEC basketball that excites you? Uh, I feel like it's the best conference, but I mean, everywhere is a good conference, but a lot of SEC schools have recruited me just because I'm in the Southeastern as well. So I really like the conference. I know a lot of good programs in that conference, so it's really good. So you're a Southern boy and you're trying to stay down South? Uh, <laughs> that's not really the case, but uh, I'll stay there if I have to, whatever's best for me. Okay, so as a guy who has nice range, how do you balance taking open looks but not falling in love with the three? Yeah, uh, if, I miss some, if I miss some threes, a couple of threes, I'll start getting to the basket, draw fouls, stuff like that. But if I keep hitting, I'm going to stay shooting. Okay, so you and I both know that the scouts have a lot of great things to say about your game. But what do you think is the best part of your game? Uh, the best part of my game is, I feel like, is like I'm an all-around player. So if the defense backs, backs off me, I'm going to shoot the three. If they press up, I'm going to go by, get to the lane. And all of, uh, my best part of my game, I feel like, is just making my teammates better and being that point guard, that leader. That's definitely important in the backcourt. So what do you think is the most underrated part of your game? Most underrated part is probably my defense, I feel like. Okay. I, get, I like to get a lot of steals. I like to press up on guys and stuff, pressure them. Okay, so we're definitely going to see that this weekend for sure. Saw it yesterday. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> so can you talk about what NBA program is your dream team? Like, what is the team when you were growing up that you were like, I want to be in that uniform? Uh, Any team LeBron was on. Okay, same, same. <laughs> yeah. So right now you feel the Lakers? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. how do you think about their championship odds? AD hurt, LeBron hurt, Drummond uh, hurt his thumb? Uh, I feel like they're just taking a break off, getting back to 100%, and they're going to win it again. Okay, yeah, so um, we, we on the same page there. All right, yeah. <laughs> so who in the NBA do you think has a similar play style to yours? Uh, I like to watch John Morant, Damian Lillard, Steph Curry, just take stuff from their game. Russell, Russell Westbrook, like just take everything from their game and try to put it into mine, so. Okay. So as a true facilitator, how do you balance creating plays for your teammates versus going directly to the rack and getting the bucket? Uh, I just take whatever it gives me, really. Um, if I see a wide open teammate, one of my shooters, Presley, if I see him open, nine, nine times out of ten, I'm going to give him the ball if he's open because I know it's going to knock three down. If I see my big time open, I'm going to give it to him. But if I got the lane, then I'm going to score myself. Okay. So lastly, what is your go-to moves in the post? In the post? Mm -hmm. Uh, you say you like John Moran, he's got a lot of post moves. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Anything to get the defender off the ground so then I can lean into him kind of get the foul and one type stuff. Okay. So just a pump fake really. All right, well we can't wait to see what you do with B-Maze Elite. Can't wait to see what you do this weekend. Maybe in the SEC and beyond. Yes, sir. <laughs>